And we are working to fight food insecurity in our area, holding a food drive with Second Harvest today. Let's get back to Kenny Beck. He's live at the Lowe's Foods in Wilkesboro. Hi, Kenny. Hi, Christine Lindsay. Mercifully, the sun has gone behind a cloud. So instead of, I don't know, being 94 out here, what it feels like anyway, we're maybe in the 80s and there's a little breeze. So we're going to take some solace in <laughs> a little break from the weather. It has been a wonderful day. I've been out here since a little before noon or so. We've seen a steady flow of people coming through. We've got nine boxes already filled off in the second harvest truck. We've taken in a lot of money. And in fact, I am pleased to be able to report Report just a little bit ago, Second Harvest confirmed that we have now surpassed, you have now surpassed 1 million meals donated to Second Harvest Food Bank this year, and it's still July. We entered the day needing about 12,000 or so dollars worth of donations. Every $1 is worth seven meals towards Second Harvest Food Bank. We are closing in on 18 thousand dollars worth of donations today. A good chunk of that has come today in the form of check and cash here. You've also made a lot of great donations online on our website WXII12.com. We've got a QR code that makes it super easy. Again, every dollar is worth seven meals. We've talked to a couple of people today who said, you know, wasn't that long ago I was in need of food. People talked about they had difficulty during COVID. A few people said they had spouses who got sick and they couldn't work and they weren't sure where money was going to be coming from. They said, now we're back on our feet and we are more than happy to give. And that's a wonderful thing because food insecurity is a big problem in our country. It's even worse in our state and it's even worse than the state average right here in the high country, in particular in Wilkes County. So we are at the Lowe's Foods right off of 421. You can't miss us. Come on by, say hello, make a tax deductible donation, or you can go online at WXII12.com. But again, 1 million meals for the year, and it's still July. This is hardly our last food drive of 2023. Good stuff out here today in Wilkesboro. All right, Kenny, thank you. Try to stay cool out there. And again, we're going to be out there until 630 tonight. If you can't make it in person, we invite you to donate online. You can scan this QR code on your screen. That will take you straight to a link to donate on our website. Together, we have already raised more than $17,000. Again, a big thank you to everyone who has contributed.